Well now we come to the HMS Bounty. Really the Bounty was known for a mutiny which took place under the Captain Bly. He was forced to leave the ship into a launch boat and a crew loyal to him took an odious journey sailing 3,600 miles across the vast expanse of the Pacific Ocean to the Dutch settlement of Timor. It was a remarkable feat of seamanship. It's now known that Captain Bly was not harsh by standards of that era, 1788, but a lenient captain. The Bounty was an armed merchant vessel and its main purpose was to collect breadfruits, plants and transport them to the West Indies. It was also on a botanical mission transferring exotic plants to England, some of them which still exist in Kew Gardens, London. Now, this model of the HMS Bounty I purchased in England and started the model in February 1999, completing the hull, the decks, the former's first and second planking in walnut and the transom and stern. Starting January 2000, I completed the old deck planking, standing, standing of all the details, fittings, yards, yards, standing rigging and dead eyes. Starting in February 2001, and completing the rattlings and the running rigging. And finishing April 2001. It is very, it was very interesting to arrange the steering and the rudder assembly movement by ropes and, and moving of the steer, so it moves the steering by that. The gun openings and the cannon placements were interesting because of their position on the deck. Overall, the planking of the oak was very satisfying to the eye and hands because of its smoothness and the touch to the hand when completed. Total hours to complete the ship without sails was 539 hours. 